So if you're on already, uh, welcome. We're gonna wait a couple more minutes, wait for a few others to join us, um, and then we'll get started. <laughs> Hi everybody, this is the Garad family. We are like in our jammies, so we're not gonna show you our faces. Okay, great, welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Remember, uh, Elsa. 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 And Anya. Yep, and Anya. Yep, you remember. <laughs> okay, I think we can get started. Okay, so um, the boss said it's time to get started, so we'll get started. Um, can everybody hear me? Can you hear me, Erica? Yes? All right. Um, so welcome to the first live unboxing uh, that we're having here for Oasis. Now, the purpose of the unboxing is really just to give you an idea of some of the giveaways that we're going to have in the coming weeks. Um, go through some of them and see what they are. Uh, but then also get used to this format of, of actually doing some things uh, in person or in live, right? Um, so that uh, that way we can kind of reach people uh, from around the country as we grow. Um, so we'll be doing live lessons as well as uh, live unboxings like this and, and, and the other things that are live as well. So uh, this is our first one. So give, give us an opportunity again to to kind of connect with other people, other like-minded individuals who want to uh, get an idea of uh, in, in uh, communicating around STEM, especially for their children. So, um, so let's get started. All right. So we're not we're not going to be on here too long, but uh, we uh, just want to give you an idea how this could work. All right. So, what are we doing today? So we're going to unbox um, some STEM toys from KiwiCo. Okay. So if you haven't heard of KiwiCo, KiwiCo is a STEM company. Uh, they deliver actually subscription uh, boxes of STEM kits every month. So if you go to KiwiCo, you can sign up and get uh, sign up for the appropriate age group, and uh, and you can get a, a subscription box in the mail every every month. Um, and so, but it also allows you to go online onto their website and buy individual kits, and that's what we've done. Okay, so we've gone out. We've bought about about five different kits, and so we're gonna we're gonna use these for our giveaways in the coming uh, weeks uh, before Christmas, and uh, not just these, but a few other items which we won't show today. But today we're gonna talk about the KiwiCo items. Okay, um, we're gonna go through them. We may not unbox all of them. We'll unbox one or two, um, but we'll give you an idea of some of the things that they sell on the KiwiCo website. And if you so choose, you can go there and sign up for a monthly subscription. Um, but these are the toys we're going to give away in our giveaways. All right. So I'll set this to the side, set that over there, Zora, and hand me the first box. Okay. Here's our first box. Um, and I'll read what it is from the back, and then we'll open it up and kind of look through it. So this is uh this box is called the mechanical bird, okay? So uh, what does it do? It includes several different pieces for you to put this mechanical bird together, um, some rubber bands, an instruction sheet, uh, and a few other items. So let's let's take a look. And again, we won't open every box. So we have. Uh, I think you like this one. So this one here is you see some of the instructions on the inside. Uh, this is like actually like a poster. So you can open this up. Oh wow. <laughs> Wait, let me see the back. Yeah, you have to take a look at that. These let me are see the this one. These are the instructions here. So I guess it actually comes with a little magazine. So so this is called Tinker Zine. So I'm assuming it's kind of like a highlights or something similar. Um, but it looks like they have different uh, projects in here that are related to the bird in flying. So you can build the mechanical bird here, and then you can also learn a little bit more about the science of flight and, and animals and how they fly. So that's pretty cool. Now we get into here some of the gears. 
some, some more parts and pieces. And here you can kind of see the bird. So it's looks like it's like a cardboard bird that you put together with the pieces. Um, there's some rubber bands to it as well. And then just some packing paper. Okay, so that's number one, the mechanical bird. Right. So and again, we want to open every box. So go ahead and hand me that. Next up, you can set that over there for me, please. Thank you. Oh, before I, before I go any further, I have to introduce my helpers. I, I I just realized not everybody knows who they are. So we'll introduce you. Introduce yourself. Go ahead. Tell us your name. My name is Mona. Mona, how old are you? Six. And what grade are you in? First grade. Okay. And then my other helper. My name is Zora. I'm twelve, and I'm in seventh grade. Okay, on to the unboxing. <laughs> Next one, please. All right, so this one is, is actually for an older, a uh, little bit older uh, group. Uh, let's see what do they have here. This is for ages 12 and up. So we have uh, kids uh, over a wide variety of ages, a range of ages. And so this is here is the hand crank flashlight. So you've maybe nope. your parents. Uh, have something like that. this. Typically, you use this in case you don't have any batteries. So, if you hand crank it, you electricity that allows you to be able to turn the flashlight on. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's like a, it's a toy that teaches you how to do. Nini, where are you going? <laughs> yep. So, if you could mute your microphones, please. We're going to have some time at the end for some questions for sure. So let's take a look at this. So what comes in this box? Uh, me go ahead. Yeah, go ahead. So there's some, uh, there's a screwdriver in here. So it has everything you need to put it together. Uh, flashlight, crank, switches, capacitors. So this one is really heavy in terms of electronics for 12 and up. And so there's quite a bit of quite a few components that come in here. Can you? Yeah. Show us what's in there. So we have our instructions here. No, well, instructions, instruction booklet. Here's our case, our housing for the crank. So you can see that's a pretty good size flashlight there. What do you have there? Some more components. What else? Some wires. some wires, some leads for the electronic batteries, capacitor. Capacitor is like a big battery. There's a switch in here as well. And it looks like a motor, crank motor. And then and LEDs, light emitting dials, little screwdriver, some screws, and some uh, resistors here. Okay. So if you, yeah, and then the hand crank right here. Okay. <laughs> All right. So let's go ahead and pack that up and uh, let's get the next box up here. We don't have all night. So. No, we're going to do, we're going to show all, all of them. Let's see the next one. We'll, we'll decide if we're going to open it up. All right. Here's the one I was excited about when I saw it. So this is actually for five and up. Okay, so this is a pinball machine. You see that there? Wait, let me see. Ooh. All right, so you can build it, and I think you can customize this pinball machine as well, yeah. So this is five and up. So this really uh, a wide age, age range. Uh, go ahead and open that up here. So it comes with uh, some marbles, uh, some laser pointers, rubber bands. Uh, when it's done, you can kind of see, you can see the, that uh, picture there, make your own pinball you machine. So, go ahead, tell us what's in there. Uh, I think it's just like up. a comic or whatever. I think this is things you can do with it for the pinball machine. This is how you build it. Here's the instructions. Yeah. yeah. Okay, and I like these because they're very colorful, so they're not uh, bland at all. 
pieces for the um, outside. Okay. Some rubber bands okay. and some washers. And then we have some of the bigger body pieces in here as well. Some stickers. There's a marker. Okay. And then we've got some stickers. Okay. And we've got some All right. Put that back in here. Next one, please. So we got two more. Give me that sleeve. So this one we're not going to open. This one is the wooden automaton. So the automaton is something that runs automatically, right? So I think, and I, I don't remember exactly. I really open it. Well, this one has some tape on it. We're not gonna open all of them. So uh, it's a hand crank automaton to explore machines. And this is for ages nine and up. So if I remember correctly, it's like a machine that you can turn with your hand and it moves a ball along um, a track or, or something like that. So we're not gonna open that one up. So one more. Okay, so here's, here's a pretty cool one. So this one is called Robots and Coding, okay? And this is for, yeah, one second, let me see what age. This is for five and up as well, so this is pretty cool. Um, so let's see, we'll, uh, we, we'll open this one up because it probably has some cool things. Okay, so you got your, your instructions in here, um, uh, a booklet that talks about robot and coding. And the robot that you actually make is a wooden robot. And so this yeah, is this is kind of where you can get a little bit creative. Um, Guys, and you got some sticks. Like, it's going to be the grass. That's going to be the grass? Mm -hmm. Okay. And uh, I think there's a little motor in there. A, a wind-up bunny, I believe. Yep, wind-up body and here. And you got, like, a fuzzy ball and um. Some, uh, some pipe cleaners, I think, that you use for the legs faces. of the robot. If you see the robot here, it uses uh, legs. We got faces, we got arrows, we got this cards. thing back here. Daddy. Okay, some program, programming. Oh, yes. Some pipe cleaners. Okay. And there we go. Yeah, you can. You can. Uh, yep. Go ahead. So that's it. Those are the five. Uh, giveaways that we have and actually for those who joined us today we're actually going to do a giveaway tonight okay so uh, we're going to do one tonight and then the other four we're going to give away maybe once a week on the website uh, so stay tuned for that I'll post um, you got it? yeah go ahead <laughs> Hi, Brittany. And Brooklyn. <laughs> so, this is Brooklyn right there. <laughs> Sidebar. <laughs> so, um, so how do you get these? So, how do you get these giveaways? All right. So, we're gonna, like I said, we're going to give away one tonight. Uh, so, one of you, uh, one of your families will get one. Uh, we're going to put uh, the names in a hat and we'll draw that out. So we'll give away one tonight, so that means that we'll have four more left. So we'll, on a weekly basis, we're going to post something on the website, and I still haven't finalized exactly how I'm going to do it, but if you're paying attention on the website, I'll put a post up uh, where, where you'll be able to enter your name into that giveaway for the week, okay? And so then, but to be eligible, you have to be a bronze member. So uh, maybe some of you have read this before. So to be a bronze member, that means that you have invited at least two people uh, that have actually joined uh, the website, the, uh, the community, Club Oasis. We're calling it Club Oasis, okay? So it's essentially an online STEM club. And so what we're trying to do is build the community. We just launched it maybe two weeks ago. And, uh, and one of the ways that we're gonna be able to build it is if uh, people like yourselves 
shared the good news about Club Oasis, and, and we kind of reinforced that by giving you an opportunity to become a bronze member and even higher, and that, and that way you'll be eligible for the giveaways, okay? So help us grow the community, and you can uh, potentially win some cool STEM toys. And, uh, and I will say I've ordered a couple other STEM toys which are uh, more on the higher end, so we're, we'll probably give those away before Christmas. So uh, it behooves you to parents to <laughs> invite some people so that you can become a bronze member. Um, the goal too is also to allow uh, older kids like Zora's age to potentially come to the site uh, upload pictures, upload projects. A lot of the kids that uh, we interact with or that are members and their parents, they've done some great things around STEM and, and creativity and, uh, and math and all of that. And we want to give them a, a platform to share that with other kids as well. So we call them STEAM kids, if you kind of got gotten that from being on the website. STEAM kids are really kids who, who uh, are, are energized and curious about the world and we really want to give them a platform to learn more about the world where they can interact with others who are just as curious. And hopefully that will compound uh, their ability to go out and create uh, solutions to things that uh, benefit our community. Okay. So, um, so without further ado, I guess we're going to, Erica, do you have the names written down for the giveaway? Can you show them again? Uh, well, I don't think, well, yeah. So, they want to do one last review of the STEM toys. So hand them up one, one at a time. We're just going to go over what they are. We want to open them up. Okay. This one here is the robots and coding. So you can learn about programming. The ages for this one is five and up. So I'm new to the unboxing, but these kids, they watch unboxing videos all night long. And so they're giving me some tips on my unboxing uh, presentation here. So the next one is uh, the wooden automaton. So this is the hand crank that moves a, a wooden ball along. Next, please. This one is the mechanical bird. Okay. And remember, all of these come with like a, a little comic book as well as the colorful instruction manual. Um, you can do it together uh, as a family or individually. Go ahead. One more. One more. Now we, this one, we have the hand crank flashlight. Uh, this is actually for 12 and up. So if you're around 12, uh, there's a lot of le electronics learning with this box. And then finally, and this is my favorite one, just because I like to play games, your favorite one, is the pinball machine. And so this is actually, uh, this is five and up as well, okay? So the pinball machine. So which one do you think we should give away tonight? Which one? Uh, I think. Let's, well, let's do one that's uh, for the younger kids. Uh, let's do the five and up one. Let's do the coding one. So, yeah. Oh, yeah. We're going to do the robots and coding, okay? So, um, I think uh, Erica has the names. You have the names? I'm going to bring them in, but um, as I'm doing that, you can do the reminders for what's coming up um, in the next couple weeks. Okay. So, uh, as you can see, she has to keep me in order so because <laughs> I'll forget. So, again, uh, one of the things that we want to do, and, and I, you had to access this, you had to actually uh, pull up Zoom, but we're working on a way to, to actually embed it into the website so you don't have to leave the website, uh, the live events. One of the things that we want to do, too, uh, I think in starting at the end of November, is we're going to have a live uh, drone class, okay? So um, if you saw on the website, I posted a, uh, an article about drone technology and why it's become so important. And so one of the first live classes that we're going to do is uh, the Game of Drones piloting lab. So what the way that works is any materials you need to buy, I'll put it on, on our website ahead of time, give you a couple weeks to buy those things. And they'll typically come from Amazon or Walmart, somewhere where you can buy it online and get it relatively quickly. And, uh, and you know, try to keep the cost down for everything about $20, $25, okay? Um, for the parts and the materials. Now the classes are free. Okay, so if you happen to to want to join in, 
Uh, it's free of charge. It's just, again, we're trying to, trying to uh, use this as a platform for free STEM learning resources, uh, projects, and so forth. And so Game of Drones, their first live class, the giveaways are coming up. We're also doing a lot within the communities here locally in Columbus. So uh, we'll be out at several of the libraries around town uh, doing what we call Tech and Touches, where we bring out our high-tech equipment, the robotics, the VR headsets, and give uh, kids an opportunity to get hands-on with those items, okay? So that's that. So, uh, oh, um, so there was a yeah, question? Yeah, so, no, no, okay. So Did I, oh, um, I'm missing one um, person. Okay, so, all right, I have Felix, Tara, Brooke, Renee, Brooklyn, and I gotta add Brittany. Okay. And then I'll, and then we'll pick them out, we'll pick them out of a hat. So, okay, give me one second. No, not me. No, me. All right. No, me. I'm the youngest. I'm the oldest now. It should be a pretty thing to go with. I need a pen. Uh, I don't need it. <laughs> no, 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 it can only be one. No, 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 not yet, not yet, not yet. Hold on. All right, let me write the last one. Yeah. Is Brittany watching? Yeah. Okay. How so, come I can't see her? You guys can't watch. I mean, watch. You can't look, okay? So who's picking? Me. Uh, me. Thank you. I get to do it next. Thank you. Thank you. That's what I wanted. Maturity. Okay. All right. Are you no, ready? Don't look. Close, Close your eyes. Shuffle it. So this is for this the, is the, the robots and coding, okay? Shuffle good. Okay. All reach right. In. So reach in. Just pull one. Pull one. Hand it to me. Pull one. Let's do this Amy, Amy and Kennedy and Derek and I forgot what's <laughs> I forgot your son's name. Sorry, but yeah, Kennedy. If you type it on the side, Corey, Corey, <laughs> thank you, <laughs> Corey and Kennedy. You all thank have you, the you. robots encoding. All right. So, uh, so but we're still going to be given <laughs> shipping calls. We're just going <laughs> to give it to you. Okay, when we see you next. <laughs> Who's that? Yeah. Who's that? Is that oh, Jackson? That. Yeah, that's Jackson. <laughs> Jackson yeah. and Steve. Hey, um, Steve. <laughs> hey, Kendall. Hey, Kendall. 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 <laughs> okay, so we're still going to be giving these out, though, once a week. Yep. So you can still have an opportunity to win something. Uh, on a weekly basis. So, uh, Amy, congratulations to you and your family for winning this one today. Again, uh, check out the website. I'm going to be posting there on a weekly basis, the remaining giveaways. And as we get closer to Christmas, I'm going to have some, some top-notch uh, giveaways on there. So be on the lookout for that. Um, somebody asked in the questions whether or not you can buy these KiwiCo without a subscription. You can. So if you go to their website, they actually have uh, uh, several dozen different um, items that you can buy that are STEM-based. Uh, and the thing, thing that I like about them is that they uh, really force the children to have to build and use their hands, okay? So they don't just get a toy out the box. You have to put it together. And in doing that, you learn how these things work. Um, and so that's why I really like the, a lot of the toys that they have on KiwiCo. So they have them, again, all the way from pre-K all the way through uh, middle school and up. So I would definitely recommend checking them out. So um, if we don't have any other questions, uh thank you for joining thank us you all. um i, I will you. post a recording of this <laughs> oh uh, yeah i see i see, see. The, the robo master <laughs> I, you know i was wondering thank steve you if you had gotten how far you had gotten on it or if you had started Excellent. it so good Excellent. job yeah Excellent. the robo masters yeah. yes, yes. and so um Did so yeah parsons? yeah uh, yep yeah. this on saturday we'll be at parsons library um doing the tech and touch from 11 to 12 30 so i'll be there with the robomaster robots 
So if you want to come out that, um, and see that, uh, that'll, that'll be great. So um, appreciate you tuning in. I'm going to post a recording of this on the website for those who may have missed it. Hey, Andre. We're about to sign <laughs> you know, off. We're about to Sorry. sign off. So, but I'm going to post a recording of this uh, on the website for those who are interested in reviewing it. And, uh, and, and we'll go from there. So thanks again for joining us. Everybody say Thank bye. Thank you, guys. Thanks for tuning in. And uh, thank you uh, for helping us grow this community. So appreciate you. Congrats, Amy. Bye, Mia. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye, Brittany. Hi. <laughs> I, that was King. Oh, that was King. <laughs> Where is that? Who? Where's King? That was King. That yeah, was, that was he King. Was here. King. Bye, I'm right here. Where? We can hear you. We can hear him. Is that Amy's talk? Right no, here. No, no, no. Brittany. Brittany. Oh, I thought that was um. He thought it was oh, like, ah! showing himself now. We asked hey, everyone. Brittany. There's Brooklyn and Brittany. Hey, Bryce. <laughs> Bryce, he said. Is that where? Oh, Bryce is sitting there. Hi, oh, Princess. Doing good. Hi, Bryce. Hi, Bryce. Hi, King. Hi, Princess. Hi, Princess. Thanks for tuning in. Hi, Princess. Is that Princess? Yeah. Bye, bye, everyone. <laughs> <laughs>